Hello students, I am going to discuss the quick solutions of All India Akash Test Series Medical 2021 TYM Test Number 4 Code C and D. Your test was held on 29th of December 2019 and I will be dealing with the botany section. So let's pick up the botany questions. Question number 91. Life cycle of polysiphonia and chlamydomonas are respectively. See, polysiphonia and chlamydomonas both are algae. Polysiphonia, it is red alga, whereas Chlamydomonas is a green alga. So, this polysiphonia, it shows haplodiplontic type of life cycle, whereas Chlamydomonas shows the haplontic type of life cycle. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 4. Let's move to the next question. Question number 92, all seed bearing plants have or show. Seed bearing plants are gymnosperms as well as angiosperms. They show meiosis in zygote. No, meiosis in zygote is shown by the haploid organisms. But gymnosperms as well as angiosperms both have dominant body as diploid. Second, single to few celled haploid gametophytes. Yes, it is true. Both gymnosperms and angiosperms, they have single to few celled haploid gametophytes. Third, multicellular and independent gametophytes. No, they do not have existence of the independent gametophytes. Gametophytes are pollen grain as male gametophyte and the female gametophyte is embryo sac in angiosperms and the endosperm in gymnosperms. So, they do not have independent existence. Fourth one, alternation of dominant gametophyte. No. Dominant is the sporophyte, not the gametophyte. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 2. Let's move to the next question. Question number 93. State true or false for the given statements and choose the correct option. A. Eucalyptus is one of the tallest plant species. It is true. In angiosperms, eucalyptus is the tallest plant. B. Primary endosperm nucleus, that is PEN, of angiosperms is a triploid structure. This is also true. PEN is triploid and further it makes the endosperm. C. Embryo sac is a three-celled structure. No. Egg apparatus of the embryo sac is a three-celled structure, whereas the complete embryo sac is seven-celled, eight-nucleated structure. So, this is wrong. So, it is true, true and false. By analyzing the option, we can say the correct option for the given question is option number 3. Let's pick up the next question. Question number 94. Water potential of pure water at standard temperature, which is not under any pressure, is taken as. So, water potential of pure water is always 0. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 1. So, what about less than 0 and the more than 0? It is less than 0 when it is a solution. When you add the solutes in the water, it becomes a solution. And then, the water potential of a solution is less than 0. What about more than 0? When you apply pressure on the pure water, the water potential can be more than 0. Let's move to the next question. Question number 95, Corelloid roots. First option, have symbiotic association with rhizobium for nitrogen fixation. No, a rhizobium shows a symbiotic association with the leguminous plants. Have fungal association? No. Third, are associated with the nitrogen fixing cyanobacteria. Yes, Corelloid roots show symbiotic association with the nitrogen fixing cyanobacteria. Fourth, they are found in Pinus. No. So, the correct option for the given question is option number three. Let's move to the next question.